John chapter 6 verse 31 to 32. John chapter 6 verse 31 to 32. The Bible says, Our father did eat manna in the desert, and it is written, He gave them bread from heaven to eat. 32. Then Jesus said unto them, Verily, verily, I say unto you, Moses gave you not that bread from heaven, but my father gave it you true bread from heaven. In the book of John chapter 6 verse 51, John chapter 6 verse 51, the Bible says, I am the living bread which came down from heaven. If any man eat of this bread, he shall live forevermore. And the bread that I will give is my flesh, which I will give for the life of the world. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point. Say, I receive the bread of life into all areas of my life in the name of Jesus. I receive the bread of life into all areas of my life. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV. A TV on dedicated for dreams, interpretation, and warfare prayers. I'm Evangelist Joshua, broadcasting from Lagos, Nigeria. If you're not yet subscribed to my channel, kindly subscribe to Evangelist Joshua TV and Evangelist Joshua Animals TV. Today's topic is Biblical meaning of eating bread in dreams. Biblical meaning of eating bread in dreams. In John chapter 6, verse 35, the Bible says, Jesus Christ is the bread of life. Bread is a nourishment for our body, but Jesus offers spiritual bread that feeds our spiritual lives. Bread brings our soul to life and brings us to salvation. Bread in the Bible was used as last supper. Bread in the spirit realm represents the word of God, faith, life, fellowship, abundant, longevity, support, wealth, gift, divine covenant, provision, satisfaction, and health. Did you see yourself eating bread in your dream? Spiritually, it represents strength, joy, satisfaction, growth, blessings. If you are eating bread together with the people, it's a sign to fellowship with the Lord, or it reminds you to take part in the Holy Communion, either personal or the work conducted in your local church. If you are eating the bread in the dream, it can warn you to be content with the blessings of God in your life. Eating a bread in the dream is to receive the word of God or salvation into our life. This might be the best time to work out your spiritual gift for the edification of the church. If you are sick and you are seeing yourself eating bread in the dream, then you should expect divine healing. If you are weak spiritually, eating bread in the dream should boost your spiritual life. If you are hungry for food or for spiritual food, eating bread in the dream means you will be divinely satisfied with spiritual food. But if you eat a smelly bread in the dream, then you will expect sickness, defilement, not being filled with the right preaching or the message of God that is diluted. In the biblical context, bread can also symbolize food, money, wealth. Others are right doctrine. If you are eating fresh bread in a dream, it can mean you will have a profitable relationship by building your time for studying the word of God. If you are eating a fresh bread, it means that uh, you are feeding on the life in the word of God. If you are eating bread in the dream, it may tell you not to allow bad things to proceed from your mouth. It can also represent the increase of God's grace upon your life if you are eating a fresh bread. If you are distributing loaves of bread in the dream, it foretells abundance, sharing, evangelism, or making positive impact into people's life. In the Bible, it was recorded that Jesus fed 5,000 people with the miracle of five loaves of bread and two fish. The Bible says Jesus fed many. Bread can also stand as a point to extend our hands to the less privileged. Eating bread in the dream, according to Bible, it says that do this in remembrance of me. The truth, however, is are you going to remember all his promises or sacrifices the Holy Spirit has made for you? If yes, then expect more in Jesus' name. Eating bread in the dream can give room for receiving manifold of God's blessing after giving out something to people. 
if someone gives you bread to eat in a dream, but you have to be very, very careful during this period. But it can be a sign that someone will make you happy. The person will make sure you are okay in life. Negatively, if someone gives you bread to eat, it can be bad. If the bread is bad, bread is a strange person, which may signify a person who wants to corrupt your body, a person who wants to, you know, you know, adulterate the word of God in your life, you know, pollute the word of God in your life. You, you don't need to give them chance. If you are giving bread to someone in the dream, it reveals your capacity to forgive and to have compassion on others. If you are eating bread in the dream, it means good prospect for all your dearest wishes in life. It could also suggest good news in the offing. You will surely prosper in the name of Jesus. If you are being fed with bread in the dream, it suggests that your immediate worries will soon vanish. If you are buying bread in the dream, it means you need Christ, the bread of life in every day of your life. If you are eating bread and butter in the dream, it, will, it may warn you of greediness and temptation. Be content with what God is giving you as a child of God. Beware of defilement of the Spirit. Study the Word of God, pray, and always be a true born-again Christian. Instruction and back on three days fasting and prayers from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Kindly read the following Bible verses. Matthew chapter 6 verse 9 to 13. Matthew chapter 6 verse 9 to 13. Ecclesiastes chapter 9 verse 7. Ecclesiastes chapter 9 verse 7. And lastly, John chapter 6 verse 31. John chapter 6 verse 31. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point. Prayer point number one. Say, Father, increase my taste for righteousness. In the name of Jesus. Father, increase my taste for righteousness. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number two. Say, let the bread of heaven strengthen me afresh. In the name of Jesus. Let the bread of heaven strengthen me afresh. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number three. O God, arise and make a way for me. In the name of Jesus. O God, arise and make a way for me. And make a way for my loved ones in Jesus' name. Prayer point number four. Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, possess my life today in the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, possess my life today in Jesus' name. Take this last prayer point. Say, I declare that it shall be well with my soul. It shall be well with my spirit. It shall be well with my body in the name of Jesus. I declare that it shall be well with my soul. It shall be well with my spirit. It shall be well with my body. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. It shall be well with you now and forevermore in Jesus' name. If you are eating bread, don't worry, you are eating the word of God. You are feeding the word of God. You are, you are, you are, you are, you are opening your mind for the Holy Spirit to come in into your life. And the Lord will intervene in your situation today in Jesus' name. If this broadcast has blessed you, share to your friends and family. If you are not yet subscribed to my channel, subscribe so that you'll be eating the bread of life. God bless you. Remain blessed.